What is something they can do right now to help to at least start the journey of healing? Well, one Great of the question. first things that, that I would suggest is be careful of everyone you know giving you things because all of a sudden now you have a bunch of stuff that you really don't need and you really don't want. And kind of look and see what triggers you. And if you're sitting on a couch and you just have a lot of bad memories right. about that couch, maybe you can't afford to couch. replace the couch but you could maybe recover it or you could get a cover for it. There's a lot of little things that you can do, but really pay attention to what things make, how they make you feel and yep. what things trigger you. Yep. And then in that um, process, putting a little box, like a cardboard box in each and every room. And if you're sitting in that room and you notice something that you're just like, I don't, I don't really like that item. I don't, it doesn't make me feel good or whatever it is, whatever the memory is that's associated Put it in the box to donate. Oh, wow, so that great. starts the process. Yeah. And there's so. such amazing places here to donate to, like Chrysalis, the home for, it's a shelter for women and yeah. children. Absolutely. Yeah, I did that a lot when I was going through my And it feels divorce. good to give yeah. to somebody else that could appreciate it or right. could use it. Yeah. 